Guys. He's getting his puppuccino. Are you getting a puppuccino? Come here. Do you know where we are? <laughs> but but we're scary. Orange Theory sweaty. Yeah. My first <clears throat> Orange Theory, my first Thai, Thai? That's how you say it, right? Your first what? Thai food. Oh yeah, your, your first Thai first last thai night. Food. You're like kind of first time with crumble because you only had like a bite before. Yeah, crumble cookies and now um, Orange Theory. Your and first ham and cheese croissant <laughs> about to get. First ham and cheese at Lots Starbucks. Lots of firsts. I'm a first girl lately. <laughs> Guys, orange theory was hard. It's like, what? Wait, go We're ahead. tired. I know, please don't fall <laughs> over. Why is the worker outside? I don't know. I bet you the thing is like down. Maybe it's like, it looks like she's taking orders. Yeah. Oh, that would suck. It's freezing. I know. Poor lady. Does she want to be on camera? <laughs> Probably not. We should get her some hand warmers and come back. <laughs> she needs like a hot tea some out here. Leggings. I need a hot tea. My voice. You can even hear she's it. She's like, sick. It doesn't sound good. Like just no, suddenly, I hate it, it when I don't feel sick. It's just like me throw her. Hi. Brody. <laughs> this is literally his favorite proof. Place. Okay, update you guys. Have you ever been, whenever I've gone to Chick-fil-A, they always have the workers like on the line outside, yeah. like taking orders. She said that it makes it go quicker. I've so it must be like certain times of the day they do that. Too. Yeah, it's, I miss it, I haven't had it in so long. So but, good, Jackson um, loves it. She, yeah, she was really nice. And we're getting brown sugar oat milk shaken espresso. Long I'm getting the honey citrus mint tea, AKA. Wait, why can't I remember what it's called? It's called the, oh, I forget the other name of it. Guys, help me out. I always would order it this way and sometimes they're like, we don't know what that For is. For the tea? It's called, oh, it's called medicine ball tea. Oh. They call it that too. It helps your... It's gonna help my throat. And we're getting our... This is where he gets excited. He, he knows, knows what's, what's coming. coming. That is so cute. Sometimes he'll be barking galaxies. His little lashes. I get a puppuccino. Oh yeah, she was complimenting his eyelashes. He's a charmer. Here we go. He's gonna eat it. Oh, he gets a holiday Yay. pup cup. Help. I love that it's red. He's like so appropriately like licking it. That's so, so polite of him. You're so good. They love seeing you. He's an eye bookie. There we go. <laughs> Why is he like have so good manners right now? He's like, nicely sleeping. I think because when I went in to get him, he was still asleep in bed. Yeah, he's tired. You guys, when I go to Orange he's Theory, I tuck him into bed. Before I go, I make him lay down in bed. And when I get back, oh my God, that was record timing. That was so quick. When I get back, he's always like still asleep in bed. <laughs> So I think he was just like, he's kind of like waking up sleepy. Yeah. Was this a good start to your morning, Mr. Sir? Your little coffee. Wow, that was literally record That's timing. Clean. That was like maybe 30 seconds. Like, I'm done. Wait, I can't believe normally there's like whipped cream everywhere. He was so, you're getting good at this. You're so a pro. There's only like a little like dribble. Let's wipe your mouth a little. It's like a cool Here we go. Thing. He's so good. This is burning hot. I know, I know. Here, I'll hold this. Or no, Let's put this here. Okay. I got my medicine ball tea and we had a and we had a feast. We okay. have a haul, <laughs> <laughs> a literal haul. Okay, don't you love the brown sugar shake espresso? Now you know that's your new. It's super favorite. like cinnamony. Or yeah, brown sugary. Obviously, Wait, but oh, you, you like, like cinnamon, right? Love. Okay, because Kendall hates cinnamon. I'm like, I get you this like cinnamon yeah. drink, and you're like, I no, I love it. I love my mom's obsessed with cinnamon. She like eats it with the spoonful. We'll have to see if you're like um shaking because this always makes me shake. I always shake with espresso. I'm like, yeah. When you just said your mom eats a spoonful of cinnamon, that reminded me of the cinnamon challenge. Oh my god, yeah, not literally. But I've never done the that. cinnamon challenge. I heard people like die. Oh my it. god, I remember doing it and I would like, it like would sprang out of your mouth because uh, you were like, I feel like it's torture. Oh my god, throwback. Remember, that was probably a thing in like 2013. <laughs> yeah, I never did it because I was scared I was gonna die. <laughs> I think my friend did it and she threw up. Oh. <laughs> Is that a good a good start to your morning? Did you have a good morning? Howdy. Brody, look, over here. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's lunchtime. Oh my god, my voice sounds horrible, you guys. I apologize. It's so much so bad. Um, anywho, yeah, my throat's kind of killing me. Did I say that before? Yeah, I think I did. Anyway, you guys saw it in yesterday's vlog miss. I made this chicken salad. Best decision ever. It's so freaking yummy. I can link the recipe down below again. And it's also in yesterday's vlog miss description. Anyway, so so good. I'm going to make like little lettuce wraps with it again. Wow, my voice sounds terrible, but yeah. 
this is gonna be the yummiest little run. Brody and I are at the post office. We are just running some errands. My voice is getting worse by the second. I feel like earlier I was like, you know, I was like, oh, my voice sounds so bad. But like my throat actually legitimately hurts too. In Orange Theory this morning, I'm like, wow. Like everything else feels good. My throat just like does not feel good. I'm like, is this the beginning of the end? Am I getting S-I-C-K? I don't even want to say it. But I also am the type that just like doesn't sleep that well, runs myself into the ground. So like that's usually the explanation. Like I sort of live with a permanent mentally sore throat so yeah <laughs> that's just kind of how it is but i'm scared because like i don't know i feel like so much sickness has been going around here and like my friends and stuff so i don't know i guess we'll see maybe on the way home i will pick up more nyquil because i think i'm running low i took a little nyquil last night i don't really know if it did anything i have dayquil i'm running on the nyquil and i feel like nyquil is like really what you need because it's like at night when my throat really hurts or when i'm like really coughing i'm not coughing that much right now but i feel like earlier i was and like last night i don't know you guys i don't know yeah maybe we'll get some more nyquil maybe we'll take a little nap oh have i said oh i said in yesterday's vlog how gracie's boyfriend my boyfriend Max, they're in Vegas together for hockey since the Flyers play the Knights tonight. And so I'm so excited to watch Max's game, but it doesn't start till 10 p.m. because it's 7 p.m., but Vegas is three hours behind. So yeah, but now I'm kind of like, wait, it's kind of good because then I can go home and like nap for a while and sleep and then like watch the game late. I don't know if I'll be able to stay up for the whole thing that'll go to like one, you know, isn't that crazy? Anyway, that's the plan. I need to go like chill. <laughs> Hi, Broad. He's so cute under there. Another day, another date this with one, Gracie. This one, 10 out of 10. Really? Mm -hmm. You love? Love. I think it was called mozzarella herb chicken, I believe. I'm like, where's the mozzarella, though? It oh, wait, melted, geez. yeah, okay. on the uh, on the chicken. chicken. I think I burned it a little bit. Whoops. Added some fresh. Does it taste like a little burnt? Be honest. No, ten out of ten. <laughs> and then we've got carrots, couscous. I'm like already done before. <laughs> I'm always too busy like taking photos, no, vlogging, seven. and we got a little guy under here waiting for a crumb to fall. Like, I need a Sarah. <laughs> Okay, you guys, I'm realizing, I don't think I showed you. We got crumble cookies yesterday, but I'm warning you it's anti-climatic because <laughs> I can only show you what's left. <laughs> this is so sad. They don't really look cute anymore. I think Gracie's my favorite is gingerbread, wouldn't you say? Yes, that's my favorite for sure. It's so good. probably the, um, This one, she's gonna say. What's the second, the cake batter? Yeah. yeah. And then third, the, I'm really a grater. <laughs> yeah, tell us what third, I know you don't like mint, but I also don't like the eggnog one. Yeah, I just have to say eggnog because I can't even yeah, she hates mint. Hate this one's like York patty. I think eggnog is my last. I would switch her last two. Because it just like tastes, I don't know, it tastes so nutmeggy to me. It's like a weird flavor cookie. But it's still a crumble cookie and it's still like good. So like obviously I'll still eat it. <laughs> like twist my arm. <laughs> okay, I'm going to insert a picture of the picture I took of them yesterday. So they can see what they looked like in their prime. But yeah, we've just been like nibbling away all day, you guys. Crumble cookies are where it's at. Like literally an hour away from here, an hour and a half with like traffic and worth the drive every time because they're so good. You guys, I'm laughing because Gracie thought when I started vlogging over here that I was talking to her and she goes, and then you said you guys and I was thinking you and me and Brody. <laughs> you just hear answering <laughs> what I'm saying over here. My background. Like, who are you talking to? <laughs> These are freaking the gingerbread. We need a hundred more. Like, yeah. That's, like, that's why I love it, I think. It does taste kind of pumpkin. -y. Like it feels like there's pumpkin in it. Like you see the little like pumpkin-y looking in the middle. Like, I know. It kind of does look like pumpkin like puree. Yeah, inside. I was like, it's oh, like squishy. Okay. I think this has a Brody hair. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Yeah, it's a flavor. <laughs> Some Brody flavor. There's Brody hair in everything this poor man, but he can eat it. It's in there's not Brody hair. It is good. <laughs> Just gives it some extra spice. <laughs> So tired, you guys. 
the TV is so loud over there, so I apologize you can hear that. You probably just saw my little montage. I grabbed my tea advent calendar, and today's the first day that I went out of order. I'm like, I feel like I'm getting sick. I just want one that seems like it will be good for me. Feeling kind of sick. It was like a turmeric gold. I feel like turmeric is just like good for you. I'm like, I love you so much, so much, Max, but it's 11.06. I'm so tired over here. Normally games are never this late, obviously. Like the second period just started one second ago, and it's just because obviously Vegas is three hours behind, so the game didn't even start until 10 but like look at my guy is ready for bed oh are we feeling feisty i was just petting him in here oh yeah <laughs> i love when he shakes his mouth in the air <laughs> max i'm sorry i'm not watching your game i'm entertained over here this is a real show this evening <laughs> but we are 1-1 one, one. starting the second i feel like Max has been playing so good, but I'm sure I'm biased and I always think that. I feel like he was so close to a goal several times, so we're hoping for a goal tonight. Of course, of course. Gracie went home. Um, I can't remember like what I'm saying or not saying, but yesterday we had a sleepover. And it was so good because we had orange theory so early this morning and I'm like having each other to like motivate each other to get up and go will be so good. So it was literally 100 times easier going with someone than being alone. Like I just... I'm so motivated by working out with someone else. And yeah, I am so happy that I have her here and we can like dinner together and stuff. I showed you my dinner, right? Yeah, we cook dinner together. It's the yummiest Hello Fresh. And I need to drink my tea and I am forgetting what I said, but I am going to bring my computer in bed and Brody and I are gonna cuddle and finish the game laying in bed as my eyes fall asleep because <laughs> as my eyes close so they fall asleep. I'm so tired. I really wanna try this tea, but I feel like it's gonna burn me right now. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna add ice. Okay, I just tried and it is like burning, burning hot. Look at my ice cube in there melting. Can you see it? <laughs> I don't think it tastes that good. See, I love the three ginger, and when it's like ginger turmeric, but maybe just turmeric is like too turmeric for me, but hopefully it clears up whatever sickness is like coming on. Also earlier at Starbucks, I got the medicine ball tea, and I posted a story, I got over 500 replies. So I was like, how could I order this like a little bit um, not boiling? like a little bit cooler. And the consensus was the majority of people said either ask for kids temperature, child temperature, or um, one of my friends in my personal life says she always does this too. You can just ask for a couple ice cubes in it. Like, oh, do you mind throwing a couple ice cubes in so I can drink it right away or cold water in there or whatever. I'm sure they get that a lot since they serve the tea so hot. Same with like hot coffee. They always serve it like boiling. Oh, do we have energy now? Oh man. But yeah, okay. I'm gonna go get in bed and no, just get back into the zone. Thomas McEwen to Wilman. His shot missed. And behind the net, Brown centered it. Loose pop score! And it's Max Wilman with his first NHL goal in his ninth game in the league to give the Flyers the lead. at the ring he's so sweet he just texted me the second it happened he must have been watching right in that moment look at his face you guys if i scratch his face right there brody i'm not over <laughs> oh my gosh look it okay it's like literally not so okay but that was really cute. They were like, it's a moment I'll never forget. You watch the TV? Really? 
Oh I was watching and I'm like, this looks so good. Because he has a shot on goal and then it came back out. And I'm like, oh my god, he's gonna shoot again and it went in. Oh my goodness. I'm such a baby. Now I'm really crying because Lucy's watching. She's so cute. And here you can see a better video. I should probably like rewind. Wow, I'm so emotional. Yay, buddy. She sent me a video when she's cheering and it's so sweet. You guys, just as I'm like, I love you, Max, but I'm getting into bed. It's like after 11. Look at how sweet this is. Ah! <laughs> oh. ah! oh. Stay with me. Ah! Oh, look. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> My mother. <laughs> Her scream. Uh, they were talking all about him. Uh, yay, Rose! Okay, now we gotta stay out here. We can't go get in bed. We're too excited. <laughs> okay, I rewind you guys so we could see it in real time. Here we go, see? And then here we go again. Boom. <laughs> Some good help from his line mates there. Oh. Uh, ship. Brown is out there. He fired it towards the net. May have got off McEwen and Wilkins. Oh, it was it <laughs> And you can see his reaction. Oh, his they're so happy National for him. Goal, and it's been a long <laughs> Yeah, from PA, ECHL. Cutie. Healthy scratch. I want to hug him. NHL goal, and he. Oh yeah, they love saying that. Literally, you guys, his first month in Reading, his first time like playing professionally ever, he literally didn't play his whole first month. And we were like, are we packing it up and going home and just getting a normal job? But now, here he is, like two years later. Oh my goodness, bro. Bro, you don't even know what a big deal this is. You're just eating your candy cane. Mm -hmm. Wait, I can't believe how many of our friends and family and like coaches and stuff are like calling and texting. Texting me? Of course, right after Gracie leaves. Gracie watched the first period of me. Oh, Like so many people are watching and texting me. I'm like so overwhelmed. Wow. Oh. Oh, you look so happy. Wow, this vlog took a turn for the exciting. I guess this vlog has changed courses a bit. I can't believe it's real. I'm so happy for him. Mm. I literally was gonna end it off in the morning like wrapping some presents. Birdie and I were about to get tucked in relatively early because I'm like not feeling great. But now I'm feeling amazing. <laughs> oh, I was just like, no way. That felt so surreal. I mean, I'm sure for him even more. I'm so happy for him. I feel like so many things, if you've like thought about it for so long or dreamed about it so long, obviously, and then it happens, it like almost doesn't feel real. Like that's how all of his hockey situation feels to me. Even like his first NHL game, I like still can't even believe that happened because I'm like, you've thought about this for like, I don't know, 26 years, you know, your whole life. And like here you are, so it doesn't even feel like real life. I don't know, I'm just so happy for him. I'm just gonna go cry myself to sleep. <laughs> like happy tears. I'm just so proud. I just feel like when you love someone, like them being happy and fulfilled and like chasing their dreams and everything is like, makes you the happiest. Like I'm just so happy for him. I wanna give him a big hug right now. Brody, let's go fly to Vegas and go meet your dad. <laughs> we can give him a hug after the game. I guess we wouldn't get there in time. Oh, now we gotta fast forward to real time. Now we're behind, huh? <laughs>